And on the line with us is Jennifer Jaber with ariblogger.com telling us what's going on here in Rhode Island top five events through rhodeislandblogger.com. Welcome back, Jen. Thanks for having me. So very welcome. Um, seems so wild, but we're already looking to the end of June, early July. I feel like time just flies. Mm-hmm. Up and coming June 30th, the Jamestown Art Center will host their summer soiree from 6 p.m. to 10 p.m. It's the seventh annual soiree, and there'll be an exclusive viewing of Word, text, and contemporary art. There'll be a champagne preview, a curator's talk at 6 p.m., and with Karen Conway and participating artist Leslie Dill. You can enjoy summer savory such as raw bar from a tunic oyster bar, cocktails, live auction, and much more live music. So it's a great way to support all the wonderful work that the Jamestown Art Center does and an awesome night out. July 1st and 2nd, save the date for the Blackstone Valley Craft and Music Festival at World War II Veterans Memorial Park in Woonsocket. It'll feature juried artists and crafts and art- in the Artisan's Village, demos from crafters, workshops throughout the day, food court, merchant showcase, incredible music performances on the stage and in the gazebo, kids craft, playland, splash pad, and much more. So it's fun for all ages. Again, that's July 1st, July 2nd from 11 a.m. to 7 p.m. Uh, make Wednesdays the day to look forward to with Poolside Street Eats from 5 to 8 p.m. Um, every Wednesday in the summer at Aqua at the Providence Marriott. The Sweet Escape blends water, fire, and sound all poolside. There'll be live music, drink specials, PVD food trucks, pop-up shops, and much more. So definitely, if you can't go this Wednesday, put it in your summer calendar for a Wednesday in the next few weeks. Awesome. Monday, July 3rd, prepare to dine and dash on Narragansett's summer trolley service from 6 to 10 p.m. This is actually a really exciting idea. I'm definitely going to do this. Um, it's a new service for the 2017 season. It showcases eight of the area's iconic restaurants on Mondays and Tuesday evenings in the summer. Uh, one of the unique trolleys will pick you up in Narragansett and whisk you away to four different restaurants for a cocktail and or an appetizer, and then you bring you back home or wherever you started uh, safely. Cool. Last but not least, mark your calendars for July 8th and 9th for the 55th Wickford Arts Festival from 10 a.m. to 5 p.m. There will be approximately 200 fine artists lining the streets of historic Wickford, um, browse the artwork of emerging emerging artists in all different mediums, and enjoy historic Wickford uh, along with beautiful art. An insider tip, I say definitely stop into Shana's place for a bite to eat and a coffee. It's such a great place. I Mm -hmm. love it. And there's all that and more on riblogger.com. And if you have events to submit, you can do that as well on the website. And remember to follow us on social media. Awesome. riblogger.com. Thank you so much, Jennifer. And we'll hear from you next week. Talk to me. Show you.